welcome and welcome back to my youtube channel i'm lydia Omoyo. i'm sorry for slacking no more slacking i'm i'm back for real uh so today i'm going to teach you how to make a classic cocktail it's called a gin gimlet i know there are very many gin lovers out there so this one is for you uh so you're going to need like three four Four ingredients for this and um, let's just get into it. To, I need to make a gin gimlet. You need gin. Gin of your choice. You can use Befita gin, you can use Gordon's gin, you can use Gilbert's gin, you can use Tanqueray. And uh, so you need your gin. And you're going to need some lime juice. I squeezed this earlier. And you're going to need some simple syrup. And last but not least, you're going to need some ice. So I'm going to show you how to the measurements, the everything. Okay. okay. It has ice in it. So we're going to take gin. Take your gin. Put 60 ml gin. This is a 60 ml shot glass. You're going to need 30 ml of lime. Thirty ml of simple syrup. If you don't remember what simple syrup was, it is one part water one part sugar and then you dissolve the sugar in the water and you have simple syrup so you're going to need 30 ml of your simple syrup and you're just going to need to shake it thoroughly there so you're going to need a cook glass but let this glass not stop you from making a gin gimlet at home you can use any glass that you have at home so I'm just gonna take her lime wheel like that to garnish it just gonna pour this um, I'm gonna save it because I don't want the ice in there. Okay. There you have it. A gin gimlet. And for the taste test. Mm. This is legit, my goodness really nice everything is balanced i like it i like it very much so try it at home tell me what you think tell me if you like it if you want more cocktail more cocktail content like subscribe click the bell button so you can get notified anytime i post a new video and don't forget to share so today i'm doing something um a little different uh someone is going to come and enjoy this cocktail i'm going to show you that someone in a in a few they're going to enjoy this cocktail so in this episode we're going to do this as this person is sipping on this cocktail we're going to play a cocktail trivia if he gets or if she if she gets at least seven questions correct i'll make another cocktail for them if they don't get at least seven questions correct they are going to make me this exact cocktail and we'll taste it and see and um, yeah i'm really excited about that i hope you are as well please uh stay tuned mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. it's legit you like gin I like gin. With this cocktail now I'm falling in love with it all over again. I like it. 
Mm. And it's strong, eh? Packs so, a punch, eh? Mm. Why don't you introduce yourself? Ah, okay. Okay, okay. I you didn't see that coming. I didn't see that coming. Why? Why do you do that? They don't. <laughs> do I have to look at the camera? No, 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 no. I can just look at you. Yeah, you can just look at me. Okay, but they'll not feel like I'm talking to them. I need to look at them, huh? They're here, but you know. They can look at my cocktail. <laughs> the cocktail is speak for them. What's your comfortable? So my name is Malik. Mm hmm. You can call me Malik or Shabir. Other people call me Brandon. Mm. Simple guy, accessories designer by profession, mm -hmm. industrial designer as well. Mm -hmm. um, passionate about fashion, passionate about um, art, I'm passionate about design. Yeah, yeah, and uh, I'm happy to be here. I'm glad to be here. Okay. Which lake? Hmm. Is this shit? <laughs> hey! <laughs> what? I'm not talking about lakes to be in how long. What? Oh my god. This one, fair. At which lake? Which lake is shared by Kenya, Uganda, and Tanzania? Ah, Tatana! I even you. Ah, you, you tell us. Hmm? You tell us. Mm. Mm hmm. Lake Victoria. Are you sure? I'm 100% sure. Uh, I should know, I should know. I have my hands dipped in both countries. I have my hands dipped in two countries. Which one are you? Uganda and Kenya. How? By means of like family. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have family in Uganda. I have family in Kenya too. Yeah, and like Victoria is, is a very integral part of the um, economy, yeah, especially story of fishing. Mm. Mm. For Uganda especially, yeah. they do a lot of fishing in Lake Victoria. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. To know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I was actually working on a project mm -hmm. uh, uh, for a, a client. Mm -hmm. They have a brand that they are doing. They want to design watches and they want to design um, uh, a belt collection. They want to do also um, small leather goods like card holders. Mm -hmm. And the brand uh, is called Namlolwe. Mm, that is the name of the, that's the name of the brand. What does that mean? I think Namlolwe it means I don't know it means does it mean like eh, source of the Nile like Victoria? Ah. Something I'm not sure, I'm not sure, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I wish Nam I, I remembered I have ah, forgotten, I forgot about it. Yeah, Nam Lolwe. It's a luo, it's a luo word, Nam Lolwe. Okay. Yeah. So do the put look under. Interesting, something happened. There's a, a, a lady who started a business of mm -hmm. selling fish just next to where I work. Oh! So, I told her I'm gonna come and try the fish. Mm -hmm. And if it's You China, never did? I went. I, oh. so I told her I found a new place here for fish. Oh. So I told her, listen, I'm gonna come and try this fish. If it's Chinese fish, I'm gonna tell you. <laughs> so I came there, I, ch chose, uh, I chose a fish. She prepared it, white fry, I like white fry, with ugali and some. Uh, some chili. Mm -hmm. So she brought it for me. Then I told her, come. Come here. I want to give you a legit reaction. I'll tell you whether this fish is legit or not. So she came. She stood there. I was, <laughs> I was sat down. So see, I took like the first, you know, when you're eating fish, yeah. the way you can eat fish, especially the polula fish, the way they eat fish. So you see how the fish has like, you take like, a stripe, or strip, sorry, stripe, something else. You take a strip like this. I put it in my mouth. Chewed it. I just looked at her. You know what I said? <laughs> if I can just guess, I hope we get it. Just guess, just guess. It's not Chinese. It's not Chinese. But I didn't say it's not Chinese. Just uh, guess what I said. Uh, I said Namlolwe. I said, <laughs> <laughs> said Namlolwe. Okay, for real? Oh, for real, I said Namlolwe. Okay, I just looked at her and I said Namlolwe. For real? Aye, 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 How did they even guess that? You, she told you you're good at those things. Uh, yeah, you're kind yeah. of good at those things, yeah. So, mm -hmm. number two. Okay. What is a midwife in Swahili? Yeah. <laughs> 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 well, the devils have risen from the graves. <laughs> a midwife in Swahili. Ah! I've remembered. For real? We had a teacher called Mrs. Alusa. Mrs. Alusa, thank you very much, in high school. Uh -huh. She was a Swahili teacher. Okay. 
Mukunga. No, I was fail. panicking. What? Number three. Who painted the Mona Lisa? Guy! I know you know it. Ah, I'm not sure. I know you know it. Is it? Okay, Aki, if I fail this. Stop guessing. Just if I fail take this, I swear, all the people who know me as. <laughs> A guy for art and design. Yeah, you have yeah. a lot of art in your house. Wow, Konza, the guy who can bash me vizuri is Halifa. Halifa. Halifa and yes. like bash. Picasso. I hope he's watching. I hope it's Picasso. Oh my god. Did I get it wrong? Just just one last guess. Oh god. One last one. One oh last one. I'm just giving you a chance because. I just need. Oh, just wow. because. Just because. We're gonna count. Leona. <laughs> Say it. Yeah? Say it. Leonardo. Da, Leonardo. Da Vinci. Yeah, Leonardo Da Vinci. Yeah. Yes! <laughs> You're gonna get I redeemed myself. A 0 0.5. Ah, don't do that. You, got, you, you, you just said Leonardo Da Vinci. You guessed wrong. Yeah. I gave you another chance, so it's 0 0.5. But you see, I know those guys. You see? <laughs> what guy? This. this this guy, is, I know that you see it's not like I, I just confused. Yeah, Halifa is watching and he's like, yeah, you, you, you tried. Hey, my guy, I'm so sorry I've embarrassed you. <laughs> you embarrassed us all together. Yeah, you tried. You really tried. Mm. So, mm. Uh, I know you know this one, so I'm gonna skip it first. Okay. Why? You want me to fail? <laughs> no, I know you know it because I've asked you this before. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna ask another question. So you are you gonna ask that? I'm going to ask point? that later. Maybe it's so gonna, maybe you're gonna be like you've lost the rest, and then this one is gonna redeem you. Why do you want me to lose? See, I win before I lose. You want me to lose? How many win? minutes are in the game of football? Ah, come on now. Come on, boy. Wesley, if Wesley is watching, and I feel like <laughs> this one. Wesley is a football enthusiast, and I'm beside. Yeah, all your friends, most of your friends. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. How many minutes are in the and game Uganda of football? Also. Hmm? How many How minutes, many minutes hmm. are in the game of football? It should be 90 minutes. Should be. There are 90 minutes in the game of football. <laughs> Correct. And you want to make this cocktail? That I would do it. Oh my god. Relax. Relax. Mm. You have four, like three and mm. a half correct. So calm down. What nut is in the middle of a Ferrero Rocher? <laughs> 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 At the Ferrero what? Rocher! Like the chocolate? The chocolate! <laughs> now this is where we activate our guessing game. You, you want us to do a count or? No. This is just guesswork. Pistachio. <laughs> what? Is that a 0.5 or a 0? Wow, you're really sipping on that drink, yeah? Yeah, it's been some academia. But there, eh. you have one last guess now. One last when guess. When you have a mission, you have to go to the I recall. One last guess. It seems I don't know a lot of nuts. I'm a little spin nuts. It's a zero for you. Okay, okay, okay. It's what? What? Hazelnut. Oh, Hazelnut. oh God. Mm -hmm. Anyway, <coughs> I'm not a fan of that brand. Anyway. Really, Malik? Really? <laughs> you say this now, but do you want another cocktail? And then you just continue. The then we can continue. Beyond. Okay, so I'll make the cocktail because I wanna. Let me make you another cocktail. Welcome back, Mr. Trebeer. Thank you for having me. <laughs> I'm really glad you came and mm. let's get back to it. Okay. Okay. So, no further. As long as I have my cocktail in hand, mm -hmm. I can deal with those questions. What does HE stand for on the periodic table? Well, I hope it's here. <laughs> Is it him? <laughs> yes, it uh, is. Yes, it is. I was terrible at chemistry. Really? Ask my uh, my classmates, like you know, Wesley, Wesley Kibet. Mm -hmm. 
mm-hmm. of the best digital uh, yeah. digital marketers in Kenya. Um, ask like in a Chris. So, mm. what is the largest planet on the solar system? Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. I think it's Jupiter. Correct. Mm-hmm. Very correct. I no, I think I'm at sixty-five percent. Is it? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Quite me. Why are you looking at my things, though? Well, this is my thing. Three, this four, is my report form. Five point five. Fifty-five percent. How many bones are there in the human body? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even hear the question. How many bones are there in the human body? What? Guess what? Let's say for five bones. <laughs> oh, the zero. Oh my goodness. Quinny, how many questions did I get wrong? Why are you looking, fam? I can't look at my score. <laughs> no. Why not? It's zero. There are 206 bones in the human body. <laughs> okay, who is the author? Hey, Norma. Of the story. Oh, God. Of Romeo and Juliet. Oh, my goodness. Take your time. I know you remember. I know, I remember, but... Why am I forgetting? Romeo and Juliet. Oh, Romeo. Where are thou, Romeo? Where are you? Who wrote you? <laughs> oh, my God. What? Mm-hmm. Think about it. Ah, oh God. Now this is becoming... Okay, his first video. name starts with a W. Second name starts with an S. So, Mr. Romeo. Juliet. The answers are not here. You can look. Okay, why do you think I did? Well, <laughs> you are you looking. looking. <laughs> you know. I you are trying to 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 you need to look for the answers. They're not here. So, is it a zero? Just just guess. I can't. I don't remember. But I know. You know that kind of a station. Like I know, but I can't guess. You know, but you don't know. I know. Like it's in my head, but I can't. Find it. I can't seem to find it in my head. I'll tell you the first name. Mm. But you're gonna get a 0.5. Okay. William. Okay. I met him says in Ah, Oh, Shakespeare. Oh, Shakespeare. Yes. Oh, how can yes. I? Oh, my goodness. So oh. You are at 60% now. Hmm? That was how to get there. Mm. I feel like I feel like I want to ask you a question that it's been really hard. Yeah, to make it interesting. Really, really hard. Or it might be hard. Might be simple to me. Oh my god! You don't say. Mhm. Okay. How many minutes? I are in a game of rugby. Hi! Yeah! 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 <laughs> wow. Let alone not loving football. Now you think I know about rugby. This is the question. Is that the question you had to ask? There's a question you were supposed to ask me. Yeah, but I decided not to because I've asked you that question before and you got it right away. So I decided. This one ah. I'm gonna fail. Rugby has 60 minutes. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know anything about rugby, just that it's a rough spot. Rugby yeah. has yeah. 80 minutes. You put a bonus question. Please, please, please. This was a please. question that I asked you before. Mm. I don't want to make yeah. cocktails, let me just be honest. <laughs> when did Kenya gain its independence? Ah, 1963. Correct. Yeah. Those are what? Those. <laughs> what? Wow, questions. Cheers. Do you want one last question? No. Yeah? I even I told barely you the answer. I told you the answer just the other day. Mm. What is a baby rabbit called? I told you the answer just the other day, like two days ago. If you get it's, this wrong... Ah, uh, no, this one it doesn't have any implication. But why don't you want to make You told me it's called a kit. Or? It's called a kit. Yeah, it's a kit. Yeah. Because I remember kitten and then... <laughs> yeah, you were like, is that the short form of a kitten? <laughs> <laughs> like, 
типа отбоя. Мой Е. Those questions are quite interesting and very interactive, yeah? They have taken me to places in my brain that I had left idle. Yeah, most of the high school and yeah. like Mrs. Chamba. Yeah. Exactly, it's... Eh. Mrs. Chamba, no. <laughs> and your friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's quite interesting. Would you like to be featured again mm. in this cocktail trivia? Yes. Mm. Mm. Did you enjoy this? Wonder what? This... I'm not sure whether I enjoyed your company or your alcohol. I'm not sure. All oh, my questions. Yeah. Shakespeare. Yeah. Don't think I enjoyed that part very much. <laughs> but you got it. Like a 0.5 so. Mm. Mm. Maybe next you're very time. Fair, you're very engaging, very interactive. I was low your expectations are a bit unfair. Mm. But your cocktails are nice. The questions are interesting, you know? They're nice questions, you know, kind of questions again, and it's it's not interesting to get all of them right. Yeah, yeah. It'll be a boring thing, you know. There yeah, needs to be that like... edge where you know you can't know everything, you know. Yeah. Then that struggle of trying to remember also is interesting, you know. Mm -hmm. And also remembering and it taking you back. Exactly, you know. So it's nice. Thank you. You're welcome. So, mm. what is the last thing that you want to tell us? As yeah. we finish this, yeah. I'm thankful. Thank mm -hmm. you so much for coming. I enjoyed this very, very much. Okay. I want to do this again. Yeah. So, tell us something. The last thing I'd say. Mm -hmm. I would just say, like, the cocktails I've had on this, during this session, are one of the best cocktails I've ever had. Thank you. So I think you're a talented mixologist or a cocktail artist, if that kind of a title exists, mm -hmm. and continue doing what you're doing. And I hope that people will be able to appreciate what you're doing, mm -hmm. and also support by, you know, subscribing, liking, and sharing, you know? Share. Yes. Yeah. That's all I can say. Thank you so much. So, so, thank you so much for the cocktails and your company. Am I supposed to eat the lemon at the end of the cocktail? Thank you. <laughs>